Um, so I have time for two more songs, and then we all need to go line up for the Jonathan Colton show. Um, uh, so uh, I'm gonna try and go out on a high note. I have two more. Um, so this next one is is a weird one, but we're kind of a weird bunch, so I think you'll get it. Um, it's about Stephen Fry. Do we know who Stephen Fry? Is? Was that a dumb question? I sense it was a dumb question. Yeah. Um, but I think that Stephen Fry is the cat's pajamas. I just think he's the best. Um, and I, it occurred to me at some point that if he doesn't reproduce, which is not quite likely because he's homosexual and so he can't like accidentally sire a child the way that a straight man can, um, and it triggered this reverse Darwin Awards thing in my head, where like if there's no frylings, whatever the baby name for fry is, fry frylets, right? Frylets. Um, small fries. Small fries. <laughs> nice. So if there are no small fries, then we're not going to have any fry in the gene pool, like you know, for the next generations. And I apparently spend a lot of my songs thinking about future generations. That just occurred to me. Um, <laughs> But, like, that's bad, right? Stephen Fry's pretty cool. And Sarah Palin has, like, eight children or something, so we gotta step it up. <laughs> and so I, I, I saw a, a, a need, and I, I am qualified to help. <laughs> so this song is called An Open Letter to Stephen Fry, and it is me offering myself up to a cause. <laughs> um, it goes like this. Your heart is promised to a man And so I have no hope to win it But consider my proposal, sir If you can find a minute I think the future of our species Would be better with you in it I know you have your problems And maybe I have mine But you should leave some Sir, I think it's only just And you would need someone to bear this child A woman you can trust <laughs> I'll put my body on the line Mr. Stephen Fry I see no reason why You wouldn't think it worthwhile To let me bear your child You would be amazed what science does
think it's bewildering to let me bear your children. I adore you, dear. I come before you here to be the only woman you will ever need. And my fertility is nearly guaranteed. Cause I have all the tools that you require to breathe. So stand along your seat. so I can't fully elaborate on the story that goes with that song. But I met Stephen Fry once, and he said no, but that's a possibility still. Find me at the cocktail thing, and I'll tell you the whole thing if you want to hear it. 